When I was searching on the internet to see how to put the seals back in correctly in the cylinder, make sure I had them stacked right, I was looking for an exploded diagram, whatever you call that, an exploded view of the cylinder to make sure they're all facing the right way. I came across a couple forums and it seems like there's several people out there that keep running into the problem of how to remove this front gland on the Western Dwarf uh, loader cylinders. So I decided that I would just go ahead and make a quick little video here on just how to remove that gland. It's real easy. Uh, the quick rundown is you remove the outer ring You drive the gland forward into the cylinder. It would be better to do this with a brass punch instead of a screwdriver. I drove the gland way up in there. And then it will expose a snap ring. Yes. Apparently there are three different styles of snap rings inside the cylinder once you get that gland pushed back. Uh, mine happens to have this round rod in there which is a pain to get something hooked on there and get that thing collapsed and get it out of there. And my kits also came with this style where you've got the nice little hookies in there you can pull in and pop that out. And it also came with this style where you use a snap ring tool in there to pop them out. So once you get in there, looks like you're going to have three choices because all three of these came in my kits. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. And then use the chrome rod, kind of like a slide hammer, to pop the gland out. The secret is to get rid of that outer ring, the coil ring thing, drag the gland clear back, and then that will expose this snap ring, one of these style in there, that is actually in the cylinder wall itself. 